Hello colleagues. I would like to share a couple of tools available in UCU Virtual Classroom that might be helpful during our fully online schedule this semester. This is for um, liaisons and professors who are teaching courses online. I decided to develop this tutorial because I looked in YouTube, looked in our educational technology website, and could not find a tutorial on the topics. Um, first of all, I would like to share how to set up individual or private meetings with students that might need or request a one-on-one -on -one meeting with you. If you can see here, these are web conferences with the most of them are with the complete group, and this one in particular is with, a, with teams within the group and an external participant. So let's go first of how to develop a meeting with just one of the students. Um, just select the plus button so you can add the conference, right, meeting with Jane the date let's say is today said okay you can write any time here but let's look at let's select now you can select how long you want that meeting to be say 15 minutes um, it will not repeat. Um, if you would like to record, you can. Only that person is going to be able to access the recording. Um, if not, don't check. Um, publish recorded meeting if you want yeah. it so she can have access to it. And you would uncheck invite entire class. So let's save this. You haven't selected the name of the student yet. You're going to select it now right here in the meeting. Since our meeting is now, you're going to be able to go and manage the invites. And you're going to select the student you want to meet with. And automatically, that student is going to pop up, pop up in your invited list. OK, if you want to put that person back, not invite that person, it will just click it and will pop back. Um, if you have just if one student appears or none of them appear, whenever you select um, manage the meeting, go to synchronize roster and all your students will appear. Then hit save after you select the student you're going to meet with, close it, and just launch as always. Enter the meeting room and only that person is going to be able to access the meeting room and listen to the recording. Okay, so that is the first tool I wanted to share with you. Let's leave the meeting. Or end the meeting. Let's go back to the UCU um, virtual landing page. So let's go here and start a new one. Let's say we're meeting with Jane. Um, date today, meeting time, let's leave it now, 60 minutes, it does not repeat, let's not publish this meeting, and let's select allow external participants. Of course here, you have to unselect invite the entire class, because you want to meet only with Jane. Let's save. A little bit slow and let's go to the meeting with Jane this is the first one this will be the second one okay here if you select an external um, include an external participant you would have a copy external link to select from so besides moving Jane to your 
meeting, let's close this, you're going to copy external link. You have to go to your email and just you paste the link with your right click and paste in the, in the email you're going to send. And that person will have the link that she or he is going to um, log into whenever you schedule the meeting. Um, that's that's it. It's that simple. Hopefully these links are useful to you during the semester.